be seen in the market. Well, thanks very much. A fresh twist there coming in from the Bank of England. Now, back home, the government has pulled the plug on the privatization of Central Electronic Limited. The successful bidder has been disqualified after failing to disclose proceedings at the bankruptcy court. The potential privatization of Pavan Hans is also in doubt after the company not tribunal passed an order against the winning bidder. Sapna Das joins us now with the details. Sapna, another setback to the strategic disinvestment roadmap. I mean, these are small transactions, but it tells you that something is not right with the manner in which privatization, the process is being run. Well, probably some uh, strong headwinds here as far as Pavan Hans and uh, in, you know, the subject in context at the moment, of course, the CEL news, uh, the government has officially announced that they are scrapping the deal. They have terminated the bid as well as the transaction. So that's the end of the road uh, for that stake sale as of now. There are a couple of reasons mentioned, of course, uh, you know, the, potential, the, the strategic buyer had not disclosed the bankruptcy proceedings uh, uh, at the time of, uh, uh, you know, putting in their bid. Uh, <clears throat> that was found out later. So, yes, definitely some loopholes uh, have been thrown up, important loopholes, and going forward, or to an extent, probably the government is already taking these steps, and uh, you know these are these steps are going to be dynamic. It's not that a particular transaction fails and you know everybody wakes up, but uh, certain processes will have to be tightened. I think uh, the laws, the rules for TAs and LAs in terms of closer scrutiny of bids and bidders, I think that will have to be uh, kind of uh, tightened further. Also, in terms of further due diligence process, what else can be done? I'm 100 percent sure the government is already looking into it because this scrapping of the CEL de uh, deal could actually be a kind of a uh, you know, embarrassment for them because this was something that they could have avoided. Similarly, in terms of Pavan Hans, uh, yes, uh, there is an issue again over there. Uh, at some point in time, you, we were given to understand that probably the Pavan Hans deal could be salvaged, but I think going forward, that is also going to go down the drain. But that's something that we have to wait and watch uh, as the government comes out with this announcement. Of course, uh, BPCL was a big one, but BPCL is a completely different context. So all in all, three study stake sales probably will go down the drain. At least two of them have done so. All right, uh, Sapna, appreciate you joining us. And as Sapna was pointing out,